thinking, but don't kid yourself, especially if that's an order from HQ. We don't have those kinds of resources. You want to know what's out there? Go look yourself. Ah, you're here. I wanted to apologize. I may have placed too much of my own burden on your shoulders. In any case, I made a prototype part using the QB cells. Like, you can use it. Oh, I suppose I haven't told you that, have I? Almost all of the research at the Far East branch is focused on quelling the Aragami threat. Actually, this is quite the opportunity. Is there anything you'd like to know? Ah, 
We're developing a plan to synthesize oracle cells meant to instantly sate the origami appetite. Humans eat when we're hungry, but origami are always hungry. It is a base instinct to them, like breathing. If we can find a way to stop that gnawing hunger, they won't want to eat us. It's simple, although perhaps not the most elegant solution. What else would you like to know? Theoretically, we can trap origami in armored pens and try to control what they eat and when, thus training them in a way. If it proves feasible, it will be easier to obtain materials for research and god arcs, maybe even find an alternative food source for them. Moreover, we might be able to breed origami that only eat other species of origami, precisely the definition of two birds. What else would you like to know? Some god-eaters resonate with others. We may try to use that same resonance to commune with Aragami. But, being in blood, I suspect you know all about resonance. Who can say? Maybe one day, Aragami and humans will no longer be trapped in war. What else would you like to know? We've talked about pure-blood Aragami before, like the QB. Lindo gave a light explanation. I plan to use the QB cells to create a portable, instantly deployable shelter. With any luck, it will help those who can't fight the Aragami to defend themselves. What else would you like to know? Imagine it. Massive satellite base walls could build themselves in as little as three days. Research that would allow anti-Aragami walls to grow like trees is moving forward. Currently, it takes about six months to build even small satellite bases. But with this, we could truly help the human population begin to recover and spread out. What else would you like to know? Ah, yes. That research is meant to harness the transformative properties of QB cells. If applied in a shield, for example, they may learn to nullify attacks the shield has faced. They could also be used in base development, adapting materials to harsh environments. It's not yet ready for practical testing, but it will be. I'll see to that. What else would you like to know? Very well. Leave all of that element to me. In fact... We need Sakaki to focus more on his directorial tasks, and less on his research.